welcome back today in this topic i will teach you how to secure your site if you had taken a free domain or a dot com domain or any domain but uh, when you choose your domain you will see over there not secure i'm teaching you how to install the certificates in your site so basically when you look to your site you will look like this here i have taken a free domain and free hosting so i have taken the free domain from the free now as a dot ml there are a lot of domain i have choose a dot ml domain and this is my website so here you can see the actual problem was this site is not secure if you load another site just uh, we load a facebook.com okay you can see the it is secure okay you can choose any things uh, instagram okay you can choose instagram it's blocked basically uh, you can create a certificate for this site and you have to install the certificate for this site so that your site will be secure and when you look for the site certificate there are many certificates over the internet but this certificate are, as i can search okay ssl certificate for do domain i'll search this and look cheap trusted ssl certificate just 3.11 dollar so these things are costly so i'm gonna teach you how to get the free ssl certificates and for this there is one site uh, it's ssl for free so you can type over a google ssl for free so when you enter this you will see a first site so click on the first site uh, choose your domain so i'm choosing my domain so this is my domain i'm copying the domain name okay control c and i'm pasting in the here okay create a free ssl secure so you can look i've so successfully enter in the free ssl site so you, if you haven't sign up then you have to sign up with an account i have already signed up with the account over here now let's move to your domain so here you can look your domain uh, you should move to your control panel of hosting where you have kept so i have here control panel hosting you know infinity free so i have i have a free infinity here so i'm clicking the manage so i'm when i click the manage i can see the option control panel file manager and edit account so i'm leaving the two file manager and edit accounts so I'm leaving the file manager and edit account and I'm pressing the control panel over here. So I have been re directly redirected to the infinity free C panel. So I, I am in a C panel. You can look here. <coughs> so scroll down to the security. After going in a C panel, you will see the file manager, email accounts, metrics, and you will move. You have to move to the security and click on the SSL slash TLS. So when you click on these things, you will see your domain name. Here it is written site URL. So for this, you should not click on the upgrade button, but you have to click on the configure button so i'm clicking on the configure button when you move inside of it you will see a three things that's private key csr and certificate so uh, this csr and private key are generated by this own infinity free c panel but you need certificate for this to install and this certificate will be provided by our ssl for free website so we'll move for this so we'll move to the c panel you can see here a generate key slash csr so i'm clicking the generate key slash csr so here is a fill up form you have to fill uh, your information over here for ssl so i'm selecting my country nepal you will choose your country and i'm uh, taking an address over here okay M A N okay it's due okay company name I have no company so so I'm R O L so 
security division it's for block so department is from the block so it is asking email and i'm keeping a email t lover okay i'm continue and generating the key so here you can see look begin private key and csr begin certificate request so we are requesting a certificate for ssl so i'm we are copying the csr file so control a and control c copy the csr file look control a control c okay or copy csr file when you copy this csr file we will move move back to the dashboard so when you move to the dashboard of ssl for free you you will see a new certificate on the right side of your screen so you have to click on the new certificate <clears throat> here you will see the three options domain validity csr and contact and you have to move to the csr and contact so uh, there you can see a bar over there you will disable that bar and you will see there two options paste existing csr and auto generating csr when you disable the bar option you will see the next option and you have to enable the next option so i'm pasting the my site csr that you have copied last time so this is the thing and again you will move to the domain you will paste the domain so i'm pasting the domain name you can move here routine of lokseva dot ml this is my domain so i'm pasting this domain over here and i'll move to the next step okay www dot okay this is the correct form 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 of uh, putting your domain so after uh, applying your domain you will click for the next step so here you should click on the free here is ten dollar per month fifty dollar per month these are the package but we want it for free so we are clicking this on the free option when you click on the selected you will do next step when you move to the next step there are three options to verify your account so uh, if you have email verification you can send this email verification but uh, many of you do not get the uh, this uh, this emails because uh, if you should contact with the hosting so better uh, choose dns so i'm uh, choosing the dns c name so here you can look there there is a name point to and ttl and we have to keep this thing in the c panel so let's move to the c panel so we'll move to the control panel okay i'm getting back to the control panel here after scrolling scrolling or down you will see over there c name record dns on the advanced on the option of advanced you will see a c name record you will click on that c name record then you will see the source domain and destination on the sources you have to copy the first name leaving the your domain name so i am copying the this first only please watch the full video many people just skip this video and directly copy the full name over there and they will comment that these techniques these things are not working you have to only copy the file or um, that you have only copy the text that is just before the your domain name so um, copy this file and paste into the record name okay i'm pasting this thing so domain this is our domain we have we do not want to paste this domain it will automatically be selected over here 
so we will move to the destination and in destination we will choose the point to option so we have to copy this all file here so we will copy this all file over here and we will paste over the destination so you can look okay this thing is added so you can look here cname record has been successfully added in your account now for this you have to verify your account after this from ssl for free so i'm go gonna verify my account so i'm clicking on the next step so verify domain you can look here you will click on the verify domain and it will be <coughs> sorts your things in the site so you can look this here congratulations your domain has been verified it means that our domain has been successfully verified and the things that we have pasted is done correctly <coughs> okay i am downloading the certificate over here so i have downloaded the certificate over here. okay download option and i am left clicking this okay i have downloaded the certificate file so i am going to the download option okay download okay it is download and i am clicking the left right click on this here and extract file so uh, i am editing this with the node plus 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 so you can see here certificate.crt so i am copying this thing in a simple way and in certificate okay copying this file and pasting in the your site certificate okay you will again move to ssl okay i'm clicking the ssl where you, here you can configure the ssl again you can see the begin private key okay csl and you will press the certificate over here and you will upload the certificate file okay uh, it has told that the certificate uploaded is not for domain name routine up so, so let's try it again so we'll move to the download <coughs> we'll extract this file you can look over here yes and this is our certificate so upon with note plus plus this is our certificate and we are control a and control c so i'm copying the certificate and pasting for the site okay <coughs> Our certificate has been successfully installed. Now you will move to the this section. So it takes some times, five minutes. After you will try these uh, things after five minutes. So when you check the installation, it takes five minutes to reload your page. Uh, come back to this site, free SSL zero SSL dot com, and you you can look the this check installation will be work correctly